Hey you guys, it's Yolanda here from My Pretty Brown Doll, um, where I specialize in brown dolls with natural hair inspired hairstyles. And I wanted to come on really quick and show you guys a finished doll. Like I was getting ready to like package her up so that she could go to her forever home. And I was like, wait, perfect opportunity to do a YouTube video for her. Cause I actually do videos for all of the dolls. But now what I said is if you go ahead and hit record for YouTube, then you can just use the YouTube as the record of the doll, as the video record of the doll. So um, I'm gonna see how that works out and see if I'm able to do that. But let me show you guys the finished, the finished Miss Maddie. So this is Maddie. Um, Maddie is a, she is a custom doll. So she was a doll order and don't mind that she only has one shoe on. Um, I applied this glitter to her shoes and her other shoe was had like some empty spots on it. And so I had to go in and fill it in. And so I'm still waiting on it to dry completely before I put it back on her foot. But as I was saying, if you follow me on my other social media platforms like Instagram or Facebook, then you have already seen sneak peeks of this beauty. Um, as I was saying, she is a custom doll order. So someone did order her um, to be custom made and she is um, hand crocheted by me, of course, <laughs> um, in the color. I use Red Heart Super Saver in the color Warm Brown for her skin tone, which is a really popular brown color. Um, but I, I love the way it works up. Um, and then for her hair and for the wig cap and for her hair, I use Red Heart Super Saver in the color Redwood. Absolutely love Red Hood, Redwood for redhead dolls. It is a perfect, it's perfect shade of red. As you can see, it's not like red, red, like her skirt and, or this bow here, but it's a pretty red with brown undertones. And I think that it reflects the true color of a redhead because their hair is not actually red. It's more of a brownish red color. And so that redwood does a really, really good job of reflecting that. She has this super cute fro hulk hairstyle going on. And so we just did, you know, some curly cues here and then just kind of had them going in a fro hulk um, hairstyle um, down, down her head. And then she does have ears and some cute little hoop earrings. The earrings are not removable, so these will not come off. Um, and because it is, the doll is for a little girl, I wanted to make sure that the earrings so she has 15 millimeter eyes and I did use the eyes that had like the brown behind them and then the black center. And of course she has these beautiful faux lashes and I do use the doll lashes so they, um, they're plastic. So they're the plastic doll lashes, but absolutely gorgeous eyes. Um, I did for her top and her jacket, we used um, 18 inch doll clothes. Normally my dolls cannot wear 18 inch doll clothes. I did make her a little bit bigger or I used a, a, um, a different style pattern. Like it's still my pattern, but I altered it just a little bit because I knew that I wanted her to wear the 18 inch doll clothes. They still were a little too big. As you see, like I had to fold up her jacket. Like if I fold it down, you'll still see her hands a little bit, but I think it's cuter um, folded like that. And then um, her top, um, again, um, it's an 18 inch doll top. And um, I used um, iron on letters to iron on the word woke to her top. Like I said, she is a custom order. And so this outfit was inspired by an outfit that the little girl was wearing. Um, and so um, that's why um, on the top that she had on in the picture, it said woke on it. And so that's why we. And then we have this cute little um, bow here, this sequin red bow, again, um, inspired by 
uh, the outfit that she had on in the picture. I actually had to make this from sequin fabric. I tried to find one pre-made. I could not find one. So I did purchase this fabric from Joanne and just made the bow. Um, the bow is removable, so it will come off the jacket um, and, you know, be used. It's um, secured with the little clip here. So if it needs to be um, used for something else, it can be pinned to something else. And then I made the tulle skirt and the tulle skirt was just made um, with solid red tulle and then red glitter tulle, again, inspired by the outfit that she had on in the picture. And so again, I think she turned out super, super cute. I love her. Um, she, she is about um, 16 and a half inches tall from the top of her wig cap to the soles of her feet, about 16 and a half inches tall. All of these clothes, of course, are removable. So her jacket is removable, her um, top is removable, and the um, tulle skirt is removable. I did do some little um, black underwear here underneath on the bottom under her skirt. And so those are not removable. And then when she's ready to come out of the skirt, um, we did do some 18 inch doll pants. So she has these cute little pants and I'll share some pictures of her actually in the pants. And so the pants were just some little black tights. And then I um, added um, some fabric, some gold uh, glitter fabric um, paint to make the little dots on her pants. And I did it on the front and back. It looks like I got more on the back than I did on the front, but that's okay. Still super cute. And so she can take off the tulle skirt and then just wear um, the pants if she wanted to. And they go great. That's why she has the black and gold because they go so good with her shoes there. And so, like I said, she is ready to go off to her forever home. Um, again, I love the way she turned out. I love this cute little fro hawk that she has going on. Um, and so um, if you follow me on Instagram, I did show how I do my curls on Instagram, but I'll probably do a tutorial here um, on um, YouTube as well so that you guys can see. But um, like I said, getting ready to ship this beauty off to her forever home. If you have questions or need more information, feel free to comment below um, and I can definitely answer your questions. My link to my website will be down below as well, as well as to my Facebook and my Instagram. So that is little Miss Maddie, y'all. I hope that you are all having a wonderful day and hopefully this will work and I can come on and do the actual video um, of the dolls here on YouTube so that you guys can see her, see them on YouTube um, as well. All right, until next time, I will see you guys later. Say bye, Maddie. Maddie says bye. <laughs>